You're watching the news on Bahrain International. I'm Hamid Shaban. Good evening. His Majesty King Hamid bin Isa al-Khalifa received a congratulatory cable from the chairman of the Bahrain Motor Federation, Sheikh Abdullah bin Isa al-Khalifa, for the occasion of the Kingdom of Bahrain winning the title of the Dakar 2020 Rally Championship, which was held in the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia. Sheikh Abdullah thanked His Majesty the King for his unwavering support and cited such achievement contributes to achieving the goals of the comprehensive development process under the leadership of His Majesty the King in a manner that will benefit the country and its citizens. President of Seychelles Danny Foray left the country last night, concluding a visit to the Kingdom of Bahrain, during which he held talks with His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa. President Foray was seen off by the Foreign Minister Sheikh Khalid bin Ahmed bin Mohammed Al Khalifa and His Royal Highness the Premier's advisor, His Highness Sheikh Salman bin Khalifa Al Khalifa. The President of the Republic of Seychelles, Danny Foray, praised bilateral relations which have taken new heights with his visit to the Kingdom of Bahrain. He praised signing a number of memoranda of understanding which reflects the keenness of the two countries to further develop relations in all fields to serve joint goals and aspirations. My visit uh, to the Kingdom of uh, Bahrain uh, represents a new turning point in our relations and um, I see a, a bright future for both of our countries. We've signed four agreements and uh, the first one was on uh, visa waiver and it is a first for the Kingdom of Bahrain and we feel very honored as Seychelles and this will allow um, uh, passport holders, diplomatic uh, category and also holders of uh, official passports to have uh, 90 days of uh, visa waiver. And uh, this is uh, a first phase. I believe the second phase will be the viva, visa waiver for citizens of both countries. I believe uh, the agreement that we've signed on tourism is a very good uh, agreement. It will allow um, exchanges of, uh, of uh, experience uh, between uh, our two uh, institutions and ministries. And uh, we will focus on, uh, on, on, the, on the products. And I think this is also very good for uh, the economies of both uh, countries. Uh, the other one is uh, an agreement uh, between our two central banks. And I think this also is very, very important. And I'm happy also to, uh, to report that we, we have benefited from two scholarships. Uh, this will allow our professionals from our central bank to receive the necessary training here in, uh, in Bahrain. And I believe that Bahrain has one of the best training uh, institutes in, uh, in the region and uh, it has very close relationship uh, with, uh, with the World Bank and this is also very, very important for our, our development. In terms of uh, the general economy, we met the Minister for, for Finance and um, uh, the Minister for Finance for my country is a member of my delegation, so we have established uh, a working relationship. We also have, we also signed what is called a general cooperation agreement that provides a necessary framework uh, between our two countries. And this is between the Department of Foreign Affairs from the Seychelles and the Ministry of Foreign Affairs from the Kingdom of, uh, of Bahrain. And having a, a general cooperation um, agreement allows countries to, um, to prioritize the areas of cooperation. We will be cooperating also in the area of housing. You are doing a lot for the development of housing for your people. And in Seychelles, this is also a priority for, for my government. We are also doing a lot in terms of, uh, of housing. So we have, um, we have agreed on uh, what I said, uh, a series of, uh, of areas. And um, I believe that uh, the, relations, the relationship between our two countries 
will now go to the next uh, level. We will, we will see visits from your side to Seychelles and more uh, people from my country coming here. And I think it's going to be a very bright and fruitful relationship between our two nations. The President of the Republic of the Seychelles, Danny Foray, held a reception to meet Seychelles residents in Bahrain and praised the unique, peaceful and friendly environment the Kingdom provides for expats. More in this report with Hibab de Ghaffar. The friendly relations between the Kingdom of Bahrain and the Republic of Seychelles are reflected on the relationship between their peoples. At the reception held by the President of the Republic of Seychelles, Danny Four, to meet Seychellois residents in Bahrain, he praised the peaceful environment Bahrain provides for expats. I would want first of all to thank His Majesty the King and uh, the people of Bahrain. You know, most of, this, my, of my citizens that are working here, most of them on average have spent more than 20 years here. Some of them have come here 40 years ago. So 40 years ago, uh, my country was having a lot of difficulties. And with open arms, uh, the Kingdom of Bahrain received them. And I want to thank, uh, to thank you all for, for the warmth and the very warm hospitality given to uh, the Seychellois. I have found uh, the Seychellois to be very, very happy here. They are hardworking. Uh, we have no problems whatsoever in terms of the discipline and behavior and I think they are well loved and uh, they love your country. The Seychellois residents in Bahrain praised their stay in the kingdom and their love for Bahrain. So happy so I joined Bahrain like almost 20 years ago so it is my pleasure to be in Bahrain so it's a very, very great great country Bahrain. I'm so and all the Bahraini people, I can say they're so nice, wherever I've passed, I've well been received and greeted. came here in 1929, and uh, I'm so grateful that I have a privilege to stay in this country for, this, uh, for 40 years. And I'll be my 41 years old, 41 years this year. And uh, I want to thank God, and I have four sons here, born here, got married here. I was born in Bahrain, so... I've been here for 18 years. Tomorrow is my 19th year. Uh, I study at Batel School of Hospitality Management and Tourism. I'm proud to say that Bahrain is my second home. All of my friends are Bahrain. Most of my family in Bahrain. I love Bahrain. I really love it. So far, I'm enjoying everything. New discovery. <laughs> the people are nice. So it's good. Yeah, the people is very nice. They're very friendly and... Uh... It's like uh, you're back home in a sense like they, they, you can feel at home and easy and they will talk to you nicely. So, yeah. I've been living here four years. It's a wonderful country. There are amazing, peop amazing people here. Very nice, very welcoming. Bahrain is always a second home for its residents who are treated according to principles of trust, understanding and mutual respect. Seychellois residents here in Bahrain all named Bahrain as their second home, reflecting the relationship between the Republic of Seychelles and the Kingdom of Bahrain between peoples, not only governments. Heba Abdul Ghaffar, Bahrain International.